What? Ah! Are you okay? Young lady, what's the meaning of this? I'm supposed to be asking you this question. I will really use this thing to, to hit my base. Oh, hey! God, my I don't understand. Is it that you don't watch before you enter the road or what? You to see my best coming. Are you blind? So I will you even see when you're driving a toy car. Oh my God, what is all this? You are calling my car a toy car? You bite my car. You are telling me I'm driving a toy car. Hey! Is this one car? Can't you see the car you just bite? Oh God. Hey God. You must be joking. You're a fool to say that. Something is wrong with your head. Hey! Oh God. What is this? See, I don't, I'm, I'm not supposed to be wasting my time talking to you. I don't understand. Because you're driving this thing. Guy, don't you worry, let me repair my car. Hmm? Madam, you are not going to repair this car. You are going to buy a don't brand new car. car. You know who I am today. You are going to buy a brand new car. Hey. You don't know me. I'm not supposed to be talking with you. If I let me call my lawyer. I don't care. Rubbish. <laughs> I don't have time for you. Let me call my. Hey. You repair my car or you get me a brand new car. I will even afford my car. Jesus. Hello. Yeah, barista. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. Come down to Rodi Bungalow 5 right now. Hello? Barista? Yeah, Where are you? <laughs> you just come to a particular location. I'm sending you the address now to come to the location, please. Because a man just bought my car and he's trying to harass me here. Please, I need you to come right now. Nonsense. I don't have time to talk with a feminist like you. You're a small boy. <laughs> I will deal with you for messing with me. This is why some of us, they call us travelling. Hey! What is this? Jesus. Yeah, Barista. Madam, welcome. No problem. Can you imagine this young lady? She just barged into my car and she's claiming rights. <laughs> Come, madam. You smoke. <laughs> huh? You hit my client's car and you have the audacity to make noise. Eh, madam, I'm just coming from Supreme Court. Hey! And I break special head for Supreme Court, they rush and go hospital. Madam, don't allow that same thing. Repeat itself here. Madam, hey! you are going to buy a brand new car for my client. And if you not do it, eh, I will deal with you, madam. Hey! Please don't make noise. You're making noise. You're ranting. I will drag this case. Even this case, no people like, I will see the drag them. They are dragging to the court. <laughs> Subsection 3 over 2. You say obey your parents in the law. And this is right. Madam, you are not obeying the law. That's why you hit this car. <laughs> if I were you, sir. I'm a lawyer. You are an illiterate. Hey! <laughs> Me, madam. Yes, a big one at that. Yeah. Madam, if you talk that thing, I will slap you. You are illiterate. Madam, see, forget about law. Hand will touch you. You cannot do anything. No, I don't touch your hand. You're a woman. <laughs> That's how I touch your hand. No worry. You will hear from me. You will hear from the law. No yeah, Barista. Nice job. Yes. She will get a new car for you. Okay. I have your passport. Because this is not a little case. We are moving this case to China. Hey! We are moving this case above the law. Okay. And she will get a brand new car <laughs> for you. Hmm? Madam. Barista, welcome. Thank God you're here. I was actually reclining in my locals, Enviro and Edifice when I received your distress call and SOS through my rack and toa. I had to propel, galvanize, and catapult myself to these locals to see what has eclipsed and enveloped you in such higgledy piggledy, jiggery pokery, and hocus pocus. Jesus. <laughs> Do you know what this man, this filthy man, did to me? He bought my car, my pants. Hey! This man bought my pants and he's still asking me to replace his toy car. Mr. Man. So you're the ignoramus nincompo, glycate and crack brain puzzle that has eclipsed this envero and locus in the discombobulated pandemonium and cataclysmic ulabalu and brohaha. Jesus, Jesus. I, I, I know, I know katabulu could borrow. Now this brother ain't call me. He say then jammy moto. Say make I come. Say make I come. Okay, I beg. No verse I beg. I never do this kind of thing before. I borrow this from my neighbor hand. No verse, I beg. You know, before we proceed, first and foremost, let me give you my rubrics, nomenclature, cognomen, prognomens, and nom diplom. I am Professor Baisa Titus, the academic juggernaut, an erudite egghead, and a lola palooza aparajik in this whole cosmopolitan metropolis. <laughs> and because you have eclipsed my client in such jiggery pokery, I'm willing to engulf and submerge you in a ho 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 kum ho ho gaga and loco gaga. Hey! No, no verse, I beg. No find money, more repair. What are you saying? No, shut up your mouth. That's the copy you go borrow money from me. <laughs> Brother, Biko, me tell me where I can, please. Auntie, please. Barista, 
please, I'm begging you. They should buy a new car for me. I don't want them to repair this car. Come on, beg your mind, a good big man. Sorry, you guys have come to your senses. My name, I beg. Ah, don't beg me. Ah, oh, quare. No, yeah, I beg now. Hey, see, let me tell you, at this point, uh, I don't have even an infinitesimal and modicum of mercy in my hypothalamus and hippocampus. Shay. The fact that due to Lomos, Gufons and uh, Bozo have decided to eclipse and envelope, indulge yourself in such to do who have fracas, furore <laughs> and tumultuous uh, brohaha, I have to make sure that I eclipse and throw you in the Skoga house whose gal and calaboose. Hey, oh, brother Jesus, more such a game. And now my sister, they take you, you call me at the house. Now my sister, they take you. Hey! You have to have capacity. This world can be something else. We must learn a lesson.